Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do an unboxing and a review on this Bissell Multi-Clean Allergen Pet Vacuum Cleaner. This is model number 2998. Here's everything you get in the box. Let's put it together. It's super simple to put together. The first thing you're gonna notice is this is a liftoff. So it's got these two big ears. You're simply just gonna place it on there. That's gonna make the connection. If you ever do need to lift it off again, you're gonna press this button right here and lift it off. The next thing is the wand. So we're gonna take the wand, it's simply, this is the back, the front has the, the, the vent that you're gonna let open or close, depending on how big your carpet is. Slide it in there, it's gonna click. We can take the wand off and use it as an extension. So it simply just slides in there like that. Okay, so let's connect the hose. This part goes here, this top is gonna to go up top. So first connect this, line up the ears, and you're gonna turn it clockwise until it kinda of clicks into place. You can take it back on and off. The next one here goes up here. There's an arrow, line the arrow up. There's a lock button on this side, line it up, turn it to the lock position. There, that's, and you, this is how you, you can take this off at an attachment and clean up something real quick. So that is made to really come off really quick. Snap it into the hose right here. Again, we're, our cord storage is right here. You're gonna put this, and you're gonna wrap the cord up around this like this. When you got it all wrapped up and you want to get it off really quick, just rotate this, pull it off. I love when there's onboard st tool storage. We, got, we can store this. We've got this air-operated turbo pet eraser. It just has a turbine in there that uses the suction air to help turn this turbine. And you can store it right on there too. Now, when, you, when the thing is filled up with dirt and debris, you're gonna press this tank release button right up here, take this whole thing over to the garbage can, press this button, everything's gonna come out, you can put it back. Let's take a look, we've got a filter up here. Once in a while you are gonna to have to rinse this filter out, it gets pretty dusty. Then you make sure you let it dry. There's also another filter here. Snap that closed back. Put this in kind of at an angle and then it should snap into place. Okay, so down below here, there is a HEPA filter. Just push this button, this filter comes off. There's a snap on both sides. You gotta kind of pinch the snap on one side, rotate it out. There's what the HEPA filter is. Put this side in first, and then it kind of just, you don't really hear it snap into place, but it's held into place. Put the two ears down. Let's take a look at the brush roller. It's got one big brush roller and it's got LED lights. And again, this is lift off. So when you want to lift it off, just press this button. You can take this whole thing with you wherever you want to go. And then when you're done, it just line, I mean, it lines up so simple. When you want to start using it, you're going to kick it over center. We've got an on off switch and we've got a brush roller. You can turn the brush roller on or off depending on if you're in hardwood floors or not. All in all, let's go see how it cleans on carpet and hardwood floors. Okay, so there's lots of dog hair. I got kitty litter, some confetti. Let's see how well it cleans. You're gonna kick it over center, turn it on. Make sure the brush roller is on. I have a switch I can turn it on and off with. You know, it moves pretty lightweight. I like that it swivels. I can turn easy on a dime. You know, it's pretty lightweight moving on the carpet too. And it's not super loud either. Okay, let's see how the Bissell does. Got a really big mess here. I can turn the brush roller off with the switch up here. Turn it on. So it rolls really easy. Let's turn the brush roller on just to kind of clean off the brush roller head.
Yeah, I love that it pivots. It turns super easy. Okay, this thing is very lightweight. I felt like it did a really good job on the carpet. On the hardwood floors, it did a good job. Some stuff gets stuck up around the roller since it's not turning. So you can turn the roller brush on once in a while to kind of keep that area nice and clean. But I thought it had really good suction. Again, HEPA filtration, very nice. Let's simulate taking it to the trash can. You're gonna take it. You're simply just gonna press this button. Everything's gonna come out. Close it, there's no bag to put in or anything. When you're all done, snap it into place, you're ready to go. Okay, so this retails for $236. That's a pretty high price tag for this right now. I like that it has HEPA filtration. I like that you can turn the brush roller on and off. Um, I felt like it did a good job cleaning. It's got an LED light, it is relatively lightweight, and it's got pivot steering. So those are all pretty good um, features. You know, I like the lift off feature. I don't necessarily use that much, but this is not heavy, but it just goes on there so easy. So it, it does seem very well built. Uh, everything just kind of works, goes back together. Again, HEPA filtration, that's super nice. So would I buy this for $236? Yeah, it's gonna be an okay vacuum. You start getting more, you know, $400, you get into the Dysons and the Sharks. The Sharks are kind of around this area. I'm gonna be doing lots of comparisons with this against Shark. I've got about six of these Bissels now. They're multi-view, clean view. They just go by different names. They, you know, they just, they'll change one little thing. They got one that has a cord. I think this one has a cord rewind that's almost identical. I wasn't too, too big of a fan of the cord rewind. Just another moving part that can fail. But again, if you could hit a thumbs up, that really helps out my YouTube channel. I'll put links to this right underneath the show description notes. Click on those links. It'll take you to either Walmart or Amazon where you can purchase this. I bought this with my own money. Let me do the homework. Would I spend 200? Yeah, it's gonna be a nice vacuum cleaner for about $230, so. I bought this used, again, off of Amazon. Uh, look underneath the new, you'll see this used section. You know, it might've been used a little bit, but it was in pretty good shape. I think I got it for around two, no, about $180. That's a pretty good deal. So always be sure and check those out. Again, really appreciate everybody's support. Check me out. Look for me on Instagram for my logo, Just to Dad Videos. If you could go over there and hit a follow button, that really helps out my Instagram channel. I'm going to be doing free giveaways on Instagram and on my Facebook group page. Just to Dad Videos Facebook group page. I'm giving away lots of products there. So be sure to go over, check me out, subscribe, uh, follow the channel. Really do appreciate everybody's support. If you could, please like and subscribe. And thanks for watching.